following last week's video showing how to memorize the mnemonic major system itself. In this video, we're going to start creating a two-digit number system based on the major system. Since we need 100 pairs of digits total, this will be spread out over a series of videos. We're going to put the mnemonics into a mcunx, a memory structure based on quincunxes, to allow you to recall the number of each mnemonic not only by its consonant sounds according to the major system, but also by its position within this structure. We start out with 0, 1. For this, let's use a seed. Based on the major system, the S provides the 0 and the D provides the 1. Next, for 0, 2, let's use the sun. The S again provides the 0 and the N provides the 2. 0, 3. Let's use a sumo wrestler. 0, 4. A sari, as in the Indian garment. 0, 5. A sail. Zero six, sushi. Zero seven, a bottle of sake. Zero eight, sofa. Zero nine, wasp. Ten, daisy. In order to cement these in our memory, let's now connect these random mnemonics with a story. You plant a seed, which then grows in the sun. It provides food to feed and fatten a sumo wrestler. He's so big, though, that he can't fit on the airplane to get to his next competition. An Indian fan, however, turns a sari into a sail and sails him to the competition. After winning, the sumo wrestler eats an absolute ton of sushi, then drinks buckets of sake, and finally passes out on the sofa. He's woken up by the buzzing of a wasp, which stings him on his face. His face becomes really swollen, and he's supposed to go to an award ceremony that evening, so he tries to conceal his face by ornamenting it with large daisies. With a combination of the images themselves, the phonetic major system tied to the digits 0 through 9, the location within the memory structure of the McCunks, and the story to connect the elements together, we've created several layers of memory. If one layer fails, we can fall back on the other layers to remember the mnemonics themselves and the numbers they represent. Once we have this system set up, it's easy to remember long strings of numbers by just pulling together the mnemonics we already know. For example, if you wanted to remember the number 1002, we could just think of a daisy growing in the sun. Daisy, 10, sun, 02. Remembering the images and the story is easier than retaining the details of all the individual digits. We'll continue building this system in future videos. To learn more about building memory palaces and about the major system itself, please head over to linguisticator.com and sign up for our courses in memory.